weenies. It is Teresa and I'm back with my haul, y'all. So I didn't have time to do it in my last video because it was already a half an hour long and I try to keep my videos at about a half hour or less because I know I don't have an attention span to go beyond that. So I figured I'd show you what I got in my last hauls. I also ordered some stuff from Cracker Barrel um, online. The closest one to me is about an hour away and I just, I don't always have time to drive out there. So I ordered some from their website. So we'll start with that because I got that the other day. So the first thing is this sign. Yay. You read it, is it backwards? It says, this family is a little baddie, which is appropriate for my life. So I thought that would be cute to hang on the door at Halloween time. Or all year, really, not in my family, the way we are. Um, so let me put this over here for now, out of the way. I got a lot, so buckle up. And then I also got um, these little salt and pepper shakers. Little, little black cat skeletons. So I had to have these because as you know, I have a black cat and they were 99 cents each. So, I mean, I'm no fool. 99 cents each for these cute little things. So yeah, salt and pepper. And then I got this cup. It says it's a beautiful day to leave me alone. And yes, that is every day. Just, you know. And I'm sorry I look like butt. I feel like butt. And I just worked all day and I'm going to Zumba in a little bit. So I don't care what I look like. You just have to live with me looking like a cuckoo banana. So anyway, that's everything I got um, from Cracker Barrel. And then this past Sunday, I went out on an entire day shopping spree with my best friend, which you would have seen in my last video. So now I'm gonna show you what I got. Let me take a sip of water before I die. All right. So we have a store here in my area called Christmas Tree Shop. And they're going out of business. They've been around a long time and now they're, I don't know what happened, but they're closing up forever. And they had some really cool stuff, like unique things that you don't really see everywhere. So I went in, everything holiday was 80% off. They had Halloween, they had Christmas, they had Valentine's Day. Plus they had regular like homewares, like curtains and furniture and artwork and things like that. So we will start with this guy who I have on my table because I got to fix him. It's this three scarecrow. Can you see it? Let me back up. I figured that would be cute for the door at Thanksgiving, but this one fell off in the bag on the way home. So I have to glue him back on. No big deal. I have a hot glue gun and I know how to use it. So yeah, it's this cute little three scarecrows that I just thought were adorable. So that's item number one from Christmas Tree Shop. My cat is digging through the bag as usual. Okay, Daisy, come on. Daisy. All right, I'll start with this bag because she's not in this. I got two bags full from, from there. My receipts and everything I bought total because of the clearance going out of business sale, 80% off literally almost everything. All of this, 26 bucks. So yeah, I love a sale. I got this cute little white pumpkin. It was $2.99. Well, that's the original price and then 80% off of that. So like free basically. And I just thought it was cute. And my dog took it and thought it was his toy and was chewing it. I had to steal it back from him. So he, he will probably end up with it at some point. So yep, this little pumpkin. And then, if you know me, you know I am patriotic to the core. So I have to get this for 4th of July, but I'll probably have it up all the time because I believe this statement 
100%. United we stand. And we should be united because the world is crazy and we need to stick together. And then I got this garden flag. Is that not cute? That is so cute. My friend Lisa actually spotted it and then showed it to me. And I loved it, so I got it. And the original price on that was $4.99 minus 80%. And I had to get this bejeweled skull because who doesn't need a bejeweled skull? Isn't that cute? I really like it. And I like the little pearls and this little doodad. I like them. So, yep, I got that. $3.99 minus 80%. So, stock it up. Stick him there. And then I got this Christmas dish towel. How cute. Can you read that? It says, I'll read it to you. Nutcracker Sweet Candy Company, sugar plums, chocolates, tea, coffee, live music and dancing every evening. <laughs> I thought that was pretty cute for Christmas. So, yep, $249 minus 80%. And then... I got my dog these pajamas for Halloween. So I'll just have him wear this as his costume. Little Frankenstein pajamas. So cute. So $9.99. And these were, I don't know if these were, well, they might have been. Some stuff was 40% off. I don't remember what this was. But anyway, it was a lot less than $9.99. And it's so cute. Excuse me. And I got this pumpkin. It says a T on it, which is obviously my name is Teresa, so T is my name. And my husband is Todd, so this also applies to him. <laughs> so I got that. And I also got a little one to go with it. Isn't that cute? So yeah, this was $3 minus 80%. I saw this and I was like, um, yes, please, because I love pirates. I'm a pirate fan. It's a bow. Is that part? And then it cuts all along with the octopus legs. I just fell in love. I just thought it was so cool. Like, this could be up, like, all year. Like, it doesn't even have to be Halloween. This can just be a, like, if you have an ocean theme at your house or on your porch or wherever this would be cool i liked it i liked it so i got it now i also have this white pumpkin it's got little skulls on it that matches that flag that I showed you earlier, which is why my friend pointed out the flag because I had grabbed this and she said, this matches, then it does. So, yeah, I just thought this was pretty. So, Daisy, can you get out of there, please? I need to get stuff out of that bag. Ugh. Sorry about the cat. And then for Christmas again, I got this Santa lantern. Isn't that cute? You put a little tea light in here and he's sitting there with his little moose friend teaching his moose how to ski. Or he's a reindeer. I assume he's a reindeer. He looks like a moose though. And it's got this lantern. So I thought that would be pretty to put a little tea light in at Christmas time 
And you know I love a Santa. Oops, I keep bumping the table and now my face is right up here. Are you, am I too close? And then I got this ornament with a T. It's got a few little scratches on it, but I mean, it was $2 minus 80%. So I paid like nothing for it. It was like free. It was free. We'll just say it was free. So I don't care if it's got some scratches. And there were no other teas. It was the only one. So had to have it. And the last thing I got is just some pet wipes to wipe Daisy down specifically because she's a mess. And that's everything from Christmas Tree Shop. So let me put some stuff back in the bags and move on to the next thing. All right, next stop was Savers. And I love a good thrifting day. So I actually kind of hit the jackpot today. Well, yesterday, whatever day it was. I found, now, those that know me, and there are some videos on my channel if you look back, I used to be a belly dancer. Now I'm just a belly, but I used to be a belly dancer, so I still love the music, and I found this old belly dance record. Let me see if I can see a year on this. Um, I don't see a year, but if I were to guess, I would say 70s probably. And I just thought it was cool. So grabbed it, had to have it, $1.99. And then I always like getting candles at Savers, especially when they're not burned yet. I don't buy the ones that are already burned, but there's always new candles there that have never been burned. So that's what I grabbed. I got this one, which is mold cider. It smells so good. I just want to sniff it all day. And then this one, which is vanilla. Also, I want to eat it. It smells so good. And then I got a, a bunch of t-shirts. Because I need more t-shirts. Like I need acne. All right. Pink jack-o-lantern t-shirt. Had to have it. Love it. And I will wear that all the time. And then I got this t-shirt. Love it. Skull. It's extra long so it will cover my butt. It's from Torrid. So, had to have that. I really need an intervention. I need to, someone needs to put me on hoarders. I'm not that bad. I'm not as bad as some of those people, but I do have too much crap and should really stop buying stuff. Come on, Daisy, get out of the bag. And then I got this shirt that I just thought was pretty. I just like the design on it. And again, it's long. So I like long shirts that will cover my butt. Can you see me okay? okay put, maybe I'm up too high. Is that better? That's better. So yeah. I got that. My t-shirt's all ragged. First I thought the camera was too low, then I put the duct tape under it to hoist it up, and then it was too high, so I'll just have to slouch a little. And then I found this tank top that I just thought was pretty. I love the colors. And again, it's really long, so yeah, I don't know. 
I liked it. Thought it was fun. Nice for summer. And then this, which I assume someone handcrafted themselves, but I love it. It's this camisole with Iggy Pop on it. And I love Iggy Pop. Anyway, so that's him. They sewed it on. Like, they cut it off a t-shirt and then, like, sewed it onto the camisole. So it's kind of coming apart a little bit. So I'm going to have to fix it, but I don't mind. Because it's cool. And I can wear it roller skating and people will be like, Who's that on your shirt? Because they're all young and don't know good music when they hear it. So yeah, Iggy Pop on my tank top. And that is everything from Sabres. All right, so why does my shirt keep riding up? Anyway, after Savers, we went to one Home Goods. We went to two Home Goods and two TJ Maxx's. The first Home Goods we went to, I got this beautiful sparkly black cat that looks like Daisy. So I had to have it because it was pretty and sparkly and you know, I love sparkles. I am a sucker for glitter. And of course I got this because now I need all the black cat stuff because I have a black cat and now I'm a dork about black cats. So I just thought it was cute, it's like a nutcracker. It's not actually a nutcracker. It doesn't open or anything, but it's still cool. She's got a little fish bone. A little skull and a little pink outfit. Love it. So cute. And the piece, the resistance, as they say. I've been looking for this guy. I've been wanting him. I've, I've seen him on other people's videos and other people's hauls. And I just thought it was the cutest thing on earth and needed to have it. Ready? Ta da! Look at at this handsome devil. Look at him. He's wearing pink pants. He's very stylish and I'm in love. I love him. And I've decided to name him Dapper Dan the Pumpkin Man because he's quite dapper. And I'm so excited that I got him because I wanted him for so long. Well, not so long. I mean, the last like month that I'm seeing people's hauls. So that's that from that Home Goods. And then, where did we go after that? We went to a TJ Maxx. Mm, what did I get there? I have. Was it this? Was it this? I think it was this. I'll try to do it in order. So. As you know, I'm doing Weight Watchers, even though I ate a whole bag of shortbread cookies today. But we'll just pretend that didn't happen because I'm going to Zumba later. I'm going to burn it off. Anyway, my Weight Watchers leader's husband has cancer, unfortunately. So they're doing a fundraiser and I'm making a gift basket. And I'm doing a s'mores gift basket. So I got this s'mores kit and I'm going to add other things to it, like the graham crackers and the chocolate and the marshmallows and a couple of mugs and make it like a nice gift basket type situation. But isn't that cool? I just thought that was perfect. I had a bunch of components in my Amazon shopping cart that I was going to get that had all these things but separate and it was going to be like 80 bucks. But then my friend saw this when we were at TJ Maxx, and she's like, hey, aren't you doing a s'mores thing? Look at this. And I'm like, heck yeah. It was $29.99. So 30 bucks instead of like 80 bucks. I mean, I'll still have to add other things to it, so it'll still add up to probably like 50 bucks. But still, it was nice having it all in one box. So that saves me frustration trying to get it all wrapped and also just having everything combined in one little cute little package 
And that's from that TJ Maxx. Where do we go next? One sec. Okay, then we went to another TJ Maxx. And I got these lights. And when I turn them on, I'm going to get dinged for copyright, but I don't care. This channel's not monetized. It's just a hobby. I don't make money. It's just for fun. So I'm going to turn them on so you can see. basically play like half the song. Anyway, you get the idea. And so that got me thinking. Now at work, every year, we decorate our cubicles for our Halloween and Christmas. But Halloween, we do a contest. And uh, I thought, what am I going to do this year? And then I saw those lights and I'm like, and then they had this thing and I'm like, I could do a Ghostbusters theme for my cubicle. So I had to get the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. Is he not the cutest? And he's so cuddly. He doesn't like turn on or do anything. He just stands there, but I love him. And I already have a Slimer, like a stuffed Slimer. So why not have this guy? So yeah, I had to buy him, I had to have him. So now I'm doing a Ghostbusters theme at work and I'll be dressing like a Ghostbuster. So, yep, that's that. Secret's out. Um, and that's TJ Maxx. And over by TJ Maxx is another Home Goods. And I got just a couple things there. I got this blood orange soap because I love nice soaps and that smells so good. And I got these kitchen towels. It's like, it says happy Halloween and it's got this handsome skeleton man with his little pumpkins and his little crow friend. And then the other one is this with the pumpkins. What was this? Damask, I guess you'd call it. I just thought that was cute. A little skull and crossbones and the pumpkin faces. And then the one in the middle is just like a plain plaid that you can use all year. So, had to get those. Even though I already have Halloween kitchen towels, but what's another set, right? What's that? Oh, it is so hot in here. I feel like I'm going to die. I need some more water. Sorry. We're almost done. Um, let's see what's next. Ooh, hold on. This. This is Marshall's. So my cat's a messy eater. She eats on my bureau. That's where her food is so the dog doesn't get it. And I saw this placemat, which obviously looks like her because she's a black cat. So I had to get this, but it is when I looked at this compared to the space on top of my bureau, this is actually kind of really big, but we'll make it work. It's Brookstone, so it's a good brand. I'll make it work and then maybe she won't make such a mess on my bureau with her food sticking to it. And then I got this pillow. It's a black cat skeleton pillow. Had to have it. I'm gonna cuddle it. And this is $14.99. So cute. Obviously, because I have a black cat. You know that now. Uh, take a drink every time I say I have a black cat. New drinking game. All right, last bag is from Michael's. I didn't get a lot there. It wasn't really anything I needed, but I saw this little storage box and I thought 
I can always use a little storage box. And I just thought it was so pretty. You know, the butterflies and the tea, which is for me, because I'm a tea. And I have all kinds of little things I can stick in here, which is cool. And then I just got a couple of candles because they had them on sale. I got Sweet Sunflower, which smells really good. These were two for seven. And the other one I got is um, Warm Cider Donuts. So they smell really good. Yeah. Those are nice. You never have too many candles. That's what I say. So that's everything I got at every store on the south shore so i hope you enjoyed this video like share subscribe all the things that people say at the end of their videos and i will see you in the next one i don't know what i'm doing in my next video but we will think of something so until then stay creepy love you bye